Hello everyone, it's Becky here. So I've received a lot of questions from uh, my followers on Instagram and also subscribers here on YouTube of the art materials I pack every day when I go out. So basically this is my very simple and minimalistic sketch kit bag. Okay, so I use this every day both at home and then when I go outdoors to sketch. So now I'm going to show you what items are inside, okay? First of all, this is like um, a towel inside a plastic bag for dabbing my water brushes when I paint. And here is my Mongyo watercolors. This is a very small, the same size as my hand, okay? This watercolor palette is very portable. And it has 12 half pans inside. And I added one extra turquoise blue here because I use blue quite often for the sky, for painting water and painting shadows. Um, so I added one extra full pan turquoise blue here. Okay, so 12 colors is very, very good enough, you know, for me to sketch almost anything I see including landscapes and the daily objects I see around my home and yeah so I don't need any any more extra colors because too much okay so this is way good enough and I use as you can see um, the ultramarine blue is running low I use ultramarine blue a lot I um, also use a lot of yellows green burnt sienna magenta and viridian green Okay, so basically the primary colors. When it's when I paint, I usually use primary colors and I also use a lot of yellow ochre. For watercolors, I don't really use white because you can make a color really um, more lighter by adding more water to it. For example, if you want to have pink, then you add quite a lot of water to the magenta, then it's going to be like a really light pink instead of adding white. And here it is. And also I don't clean my palette because for watercolors it's really special. You can re-wet the areas of colors and you can use the color again. Okay, especially these greens. So I don't have to spend time again mixing new colors. I can just reuse these colors. Okay, next time when I sketch. And here's my watercolor palette. See what else are inside. So when I sketch in my art journal or sketchbook, I always begin by drawing outlines and the details first with fine liner pens. So here in this bag, I have five fine liners. These are all the same brand. Unipin fine liners, ranging from the size of 0.8 millimeter tips and to 0 0.05 and so most often I use 0 0.8 and 0 0.5 to draw the general outlines of the things I see and then I use 0 0.2, 0 0.1 or 0 0.3 to add the inside details and like textures okay so these are the pens I use for drawing in the beginning and then after drawing I use these water brushes so I use these water brushes to paint and this one is a whole bane water brush the tip is bigger it's a round tip water brush some brands um, they sell flat water brushes but I tried those before I don't think they're very useful um, I like this one because um, it can cover a broad area really fast. This big round tip brush pen. Or what it's actually called water brush officially. These two are Sakura water brushes and the tips are thinner and so you can do more fine line details with these fine tipped brushes. And I'll show you later how to use these water brushes, okay? What else are here in my bag? 
So I rarely use these. So this one is a brown uh, color pencil, a regular 2B drawing pencil, and the blue china marker. So sometimes I use these to do like um, borders around my sketches, like a frame. And this one is a white jelly pen. So sometimes I may want to add some highlights by just um, adding some white colors on top of my finished sketches. I don't use these very often. So let's put these back. And here's my backpack that I use when I go out. So basically I have I have my phone and my wallet for these, my sketchbook, and my sketch kit bag. Okay, everything in here. It's very light. Okay, nice and light. Because for me, I like to be minimal because I don't want to get so stressed out by, you know, having a whole heavy bag of materials. Because when I sketch, I I always sketch really fast. I try to sketch the things as fast as I can because I'm always on the go. Sometimes I'm out with friends and with family. So I have to sketch really fast. Okay, so, uh, so that's why I use like very minimal tools. I just draw with one or two fine liner pens quickly in about uh, 15 minutes. To 30 to 30 minutes and then I took another 15 to 30 minutes to paint with my watercolors and a water brush um, Yeah, as fast as I can so I don't need to think about you know What other materials I, I use because that's too much too much to think and that really kind of uh, not supporting my creative activity You know, I feel like having too much art materials not really supporting my creativity Right? We can, I believe we can still be creative with very minimal uh, tools. Because I remember uh, Van Gogh was creative enough when he only had paper and charcoal or pencils to sketch. Okay? So we don't need a room of art materials to get creative and to be productive.